One of the problems that we see in calves that are weaned is coccidiosis. Now coccidiosis is a protozoan parasite that infects the digestive tracts of animals. It's very species specific, so I can remember getting calls from people asking if my dog uh, has infected my calf with coccidiosis. No, if a calf has coccidiosis, it comes from a cow. If any of the other animals, it will come from them specifically. Typically, we see coccidiosis following a stressful event, such as weaning, or if we change a feed, or if we maybe transport these cattle some distance, uh, we'll typically see this, this disease break. Uh, these cattle are infected with the oocysts or eggs. Uh, these eggs are passed through the fecal material of not only sick animals, but also healthy animals. So it is going to be in the environment where you are. Typically, cattle ingest it, and depending upon how many of those eggs they ingest will influence the severity of the disease. If they ingest a lot, they're gonna get a lot sicker than those that just ingest a few. Clinical signs of this disease are usually diarrhea with or without blood. Now in milder forms, you may not even notice the disease, but you do have some production problems like you're gonna have lower weight gains. In the severe diseases with a lot of diarrhea, a secondary problem on occasion is you will get prolapsed rectums. Uh, when we treat this disease, we normally use a sulfur drug or amproleum. What we need to keep in mind though is that when we treat those severely infected animals, we have to realize that most of the animals that are with that group are probably going to be infected. So we need to do something for them also, like put a coccidiostat in the water or in the feed. And that will usually keep the disease in check. If you'd like some more information about coccidiosis in cattle, if you'll go to sunup.okstate.edu.